First thing in the morning, prepare the NMN powder with water. Take one scoop of NMN and put it in the measuring cup. And then use room temp water to mix. It dissolves pretty readily. Just give it a few stirs and add a little splash of water more if you need to. No more than about half of the medicine cup full. And once it's mixed, it's ready for grandma to hold under her tongue for 60 seconds. For the yogurt with collagen protein, we also add the resveratrol in this one and some vitamin D. You're gonna start with the two scoops of the collagen protein in the bottom of the cup. And then you're gonna add four spoonfuls of the full fat A2 yogurt. and then a generous splash of maple syrup to sweeten it up. And this is gonna be just enough yogurt to dissolve the collagen and the resveratrol. And uh, that's just enough maple syrup to take the edge off of the tang of that yogurt. Go ahead and stir it all together. The collagen can be a little sticky at first, but it's like kind of like gelatin. Once it starts to dissolve, then it dissolves pretty fast. And then you're gonna take a drop of the vitamin D3 supplement. It's just one drop. And note that if you're using the vitamin D pills that are still left, you don't have to add the drop. It's just either or. And uh, one scoop of resveratrol. Go ahead and stir that in. And once it's smooth, you can go ahead and add the fruit. So we're gonna add some frozen wild blueberries. We just pour a dash in frozen and then they thaw in the bowl. And give them a quick stir. And then we put a small spoonful of wild blueberry jam on top. This can be any jam just sweetens it up a little bit. We liked that particular jam because there's no added sugar other than fruit juice. And then one more splash of maple syrup to sweeten it up. And that's to grandma's taste and it's served with one pill of the methylfolate. After you mix up the yogurt, it's nice to make the whole beast protein shake as well and get that in the fridge so it's chilling down for after her workout. So you're gonna add one scoop of whole beast protein to a shaker bottle. Pour in about 10 ounces of room temp water. It dissolves a lot better when it's room temp. and there's a line on the side of the shaker bottle that denotes the ounces. Just give it a stir. And it'll start to dissolve pretty well. You'll still see some clumps, but that's okay. And then give it a good shake after you tighten that lid on top and drop it in the fridge for later.